going. There's another live one right there. So apparently we're at low tide right now. We're in Laguna Beach, right? Mm -hmm. uh, the town of Laguna. And it's beautiful, but there's low tide and we're going to look at a whole symphony of life down here. Check this out. So we've got this little crab right over here crawling along the mussels. Nice little close shore up. crab. If he were only about six inches bigger, we could eat him. I see. <laughs> Another nice close up. Yeah, watch this. Try to step on the rocks and not on the not mussels. Not on the mussels, because there's mussels everywhere here. Yeah, so he's hiding underneath the mussels. There he is. And all along the edge, you see those flat, almost clamshell like things. Those are limpets. Those are also very tasty to eat. Mm hmm. Um, where did that little hermit crab go? He's hiding under there. But there's a sea anemone right there. What else we have? Tons of sea anemones over there. And there's a, oh, there's another little hermit crab. Right. Crawling along right down here. You can barely see him moving. Let's see if I can find him. It's right. I see oh, him. Oh, there he is. Trying to be inconspicuous. Right there. Mm -hmm. Is that moving at the moment? Yep, and it's that's why it's so important people don't touch the animals. And mm -hmm. every time you touch them, you can cause them harm, and people don't realize how easy it is to kill them. There's a lot of beaches along California that are totally rocky now. There's no animal life at all. That's sad. Yeah, there's another little hermit crab crawling, crawling along that. I see. Let's see if I can get that one while, while he's in action. Mm -hmm. Come on, little guy, move. Move for the camera. Okay, here's one. Maybe this guy will move. Move for the camera. Move. They know. They just, they know. They're all over the place. Oh, there's a little teeny one. He's really small. Yeah, I see him. Yeah, it looks like the guy from The Little Mermaid. Lots of mussels. Yes. Tasty. Everywhere. Tasty, And they're tasty. so good. I love mussels. I'll do a slow panoramic view of this area. It's because it's awesome. Pelicans over there. Let's go to another pool and see if we can just luck out. I'll do it live on video. I'll try to stay whoops on the rock and not on the muscle. <laughs> Here's another pool of stuff. All I see is seaweed here. But it's feeding everything. But it's feeding everything. Yep. There's a purpose. It's feeding everything. Shelly, maybe she'll find a pool of more life we can watch that's moving and doing something. You just have to be really patient. Oh, there's little teeny hermit crabs. Oh, there's little teeny ones all over the place oh, down there. Little it. ones. I don't know if it's come up on camera or not. Great anemones here. They're they're actually really good to eat. <laughs> there's a, a crab right there. Yep, I see him. And another one down in the water. He's moving. Hopefully that it'll show up on camera. There's a bunch of them in here. Every little teeny movement you see. If you just like stare at one thing, you can see the movement in the periphery of your eye. All right, close there. up right down there. So you see several of them moving at once. Yeah. All that life down there. And one of them dies, and it just for no good reason, and it just destroys everything. But everything in here you can eat. The red the red kale and the anemones, the, the hermit crabs if they were larger. Of course all fish will eat those. Seagulls. Mussels of course. Limpets. All the barnacles. Barnacles. Yeah, barnacles aren't I actually had a barnacle and they're not very tasty, but if I had to eat, I probably could live off of them. <laughs> I can't get over how many mussels there are. I mean, do yeah. they eventually dry up and die? Um, no, they just keep proliferating. I they mean, something will eat them, and they'll just keep growing, and then, then they'll eventually die, I mean, when they reach their peak, but... Keep, 
budding and growing. Amazing. And all these limpets down here, these are a delicacy in uh, Polynesia. They, they grow off cliffs and people will actually hang over cliffs to pick them off. You have to get a, something really sharp underneath and pick them off. Limpets are very, very good. It's kind of like a clam, but it's buttery. Hmm, interesting. Oh, Pihi. That's a Hawaiian word for limpet. So that's my low tide video coming at you from Laguna Beach, Laguna, California. Beautiful day, January 8th, and it's 70 something degrees in January. A guy that's from Wisconsin really appreciates this weather in January.